Right, what I'll just do is come, forgot to show you my uh, collection behind the door. Got the, all the bomb films, including up to Spectre, which is not my favourite, but it works out cheaper just buying these all anyway, one block. DVD, uh, DVD, VHS, Wizard of Oz, double pack with Chitty Bang Bang. Not many have seen many of these. Just got some uh, CDs there, mainly my wife's and a couple of mine. And then just a few games for the consoles we got. Xbox, I love the Xbox original. PlayStation 2 is probably my favourite console of all time. Been playing uh, many games. Grand Theft Auto, I love that game. I can't get enough of that. Obviously, I've got a uh, PS3, Motorstorm. I don't own a lot of games for that. I've got a couple of PlayStation 1s, Philosopher's Stone, which my Mrs. Loves, Aladdin, Chitty Bang Bang Blu ray. Watch that one endlessly. Luckily, my wife likes watching it. All the Planet of the Apes films. I nicked this one off my son. Probably didn't even know it had gone. But only because I like watching them. Uh, and then obviously you've got Force Awakens. Waiting for Rogue One to come out. Got Mamma Mia. We all like that one. Picked it up for a couple of quid in the shop. And then we just got some random. Don't have to go through them all, Mark. I'll just pan them over. Turtles, all the Turtles series. Well, ones are released anyway. Got uh, Joe 90. Thunderbirds. Big Bang Theory, my wishes, loves. And then we've got uh, Dungeons and Dragons. Got the Dark Knights, all Bruce Lee's. Love Bruce Lee. Uh, studied JKD uh, with uh, Dan in the Santo and Bob Breen in the 80s. So uh, anyone who knows Dan in the Santo, he was a student of uh, Bruce Lee. So pretty cool. Though no, you don't realise it at the time. But And then Superman, Batman. Jungle Book, my favourite Disney film. You can't beat Jungle Book, the original. That's great. So, uh, yeah. So, uh, yeah, we're going to carry on from where we were. Uh, so, we've got my, I think we started from here, got my remote control fun, uh, Fab 1. Repaired that. Got. Uh, Buzz Lightyear reporting for sector duty. That, that was from B&M, was supposed to be thirty nine ninety nine, but they mispriced it on the shelf, so we got it for twenty four ninety nine. Got me and Mrs's Harry Potter, she hasn't got them all, uh, that one's mine, she bought me that one, because I think she's great. And then obviously uh, Black and uh, oh God. Serious Snape. Yeah, that's it, Snape. She should think I know that one. <laughs> Then down here we just had my Superman bit. I'm just trying to get some more bits for that. Down here we remember statues I got from my son and my wife. Down there and we've got a puppet there from the uh, 90s. Quite like that. And this was my, the crows, my wife's. It's the NECA one talking. It's probably the best one out there. We've looked at many other ones but nothing really stands close to that one. Like facial or... So, quite pleased with that. Right, if we go across here, this is kind of our little random Harry Potter pictures. Uh, we did originally buy eight, uh, but this one here, we got one that had the, um, it was a, a sample copy. So, we, so they sent, he sent us this one, and then he sent us another six free. So that was pretty cool. My wife was very happy. So here we have just my missus's bit of random, Robbie the Robot, some uh, robot figures there, wind-ups. I've got my like buying her bits and pieces that she likes. So and then we've got Penfold here, we got obviously Star Lord here. There's one other name you might know me by. Star Lord. Which is pretty cool. So uh I've got Lucy there from Peanuts. It's a very random shelf. Got a 1970s Frankenstein. I love Frankenstein. Got all the Harry Potter books. Um, she's not very keen on Fantastic Beasts. 
because it's a screenplay rather than a proper book. But hopefully J.K. Rowling could do another book. Then it, they got the, the bookends I bought her for her birthday. It was pretty cool. And Hagrid on the other end. So. And down here we, like, we've got some more Harry Potter leaflets there. And then we have my talking Darth Vader there. When you press his... Uh, Pretty cool. I am the master. I didn't, I didn't watch that. Well, I do. Got my TIE Fighter Power of the Force. Power of the Force there. And then we got my Brave Star stagecoach there, complete. And then we got my Castle Grey Skull there with He Man on top. And then we come up here, we have my Transformers. Got a good deal on these. That one transforms into five different transformers. And Optimus Prime, I love that version. The uh, Power Master, Soundwave, the MP3 player, which actually turns into uh, Soundwave. Then we have uh, Brave Star. Bit ages trying to get hold of him. Managed to get hold of him. Complete Brave Star. Complete Tex Hex. He's missing. Uh, his vehicle and his star on his hat, but we don't really care. His eyes always creep me out. Yeah, they certainly do. And then uh, down here, we have my James Bond, big James Bond fan. That's vehicle my wife bought me three years ago. No, you didn't buy it. No, we both bought it. Did you? Yeah. Oh. Well, anyway, three years ago. So, uh, and my uh, vintage Lotus from Spy Love Me. Got my little Nelly there. I love that vehicle. And then down here we've got my box to uh, Spyro Love Me James Bond Action Man. And then we've got my mask Hurricane there with his driver. <coughs> General General Lee there, wind up, goes along. Got my Manta Force figures there. Got my Thundercats figure there. I did own a hell of a lot of Manta Force, but got rid of it. Here we've got my uh, ATST. Uh, AT. Uh, uh, there, remote control. Got my uh, Ray figure at the background. And uh, got my uh, collection of micro machines my, my son gave me. Because I, I like TIE Fighters and that. So, uh, and then we've got obviously, uh, I forgot what her name is now. From Rogue One. What's her name uh, even? Right, it's down there anyway. I do apologise, I normally try to make sure I know what I'm talking about. But she's there, and I've got my Millennium Micro Machine there. And then down here, this is mainly the uh, toys, well, things I remember as a child. You've got my son, Matchbox figures there, all complete with the accessories. You've got a Corgi firing, very much like Dinky, but uh, it does everything exactly the same. It's pretty cool. Got my Lady Penelope there, she's a fairy light doll. Got my Action Man box there, quite pleased to have him. And then if you look over there, I've got my JR21 Thunderbird 3. Box has seen better days, but uh, you know, it's still there and it's still artwork. I like looking at the artwork. And then you've got Dr. Mott there from Camberwick Green, my favourite uh, kids uh, series as a child. Got my Chitty Chitty Bang Bang there, and that's the Husky version. And then that car there I definitely had as a child, it's not the original one. But I had loads of their Matchbox ones there. Uh, yeah, Joe 90 there. Got Planet the Apes figures there from uh, Cubix, I've got loads of them. But they're not all out on display. And we're in the process of going to get some more cabinets. And here we just have my, well ours really. PS3, Xbox 360, because my son upgraded at Christmas to an Xbox One. So he's let us use this, which my wife uses for the exercise on the Kinect. Xbox Original, we'll go just start in Halo 2. Need to get on that at the weekend. And the PlayStation 2, which is awesome. I love that console with my, my favourite game. So I think that's everything in it. Um... <clears throat>
No, I don't need to worry about that. Oh. Uh, though my wife does collect uh, kind of teapots and so there's some random things on this. It's like uh, thing. So anyway, so uh, apart from being blinded, thank you for watching. I know it's a very uh, long two-part video, but I wanted to show you that you know it's not just me who collects we all collect something different or different bits my son's into clone wars and boba fett my wife's into zoom zooms and so it's quite nice collecting as a family so anyway thank you for watching and hope you've enjoyed my video please subscribe and uh, like if you don't mind just helps me know what people actually enjoy my videos so uh, thank you for watching and uh, see you next time